At LEX 18, we're working to help our community and neighbors get what they need to move forward through these tough times brought on by the coronavirus pandemic. Nancy has tonight's edition of The Rebound Kentucky. The Sweet 16 and Keeneland are just two reasons to visit Lexington in the spring. Unfortunately, those events were canceled along with at least 90 meetings and conventions through June, meaning millions of dollars lost in revenue in Lexington. LEX 18's Conroy Deluge has more on the city's loss, plans for recovery and optimism for the future. Even in the darkness of COVID-19, the sun shines bright on beautiful downtown buildings, symbols of progress and growth in Lexington, now sitting mostly vacant. It, it hurts. It's, it's a painful reality that we've all been in these last five weeks. Mary Quinn Raymer is the president of Visit Lex, the city's tourism office. Her job is to attract visitors, conventions, and yes, crowds to Lexington. There was so much momentum in the city. Momentum that has slowed considerably since social distancing became the new reality. As the virus continued to spread, concerts and conventions were canceled and hotels emptied out as travel grounded to a halt. Then um, you don't have, you know, you don't have rooms sold at hotels and you don't have tax dollars coming in as a result of that. And those tax dollars are what Visit Lex relies on for funding. In just a three week span, the city lost nearly $12 million in hotel revenue compared to the same time frame last year, a nearly $500,000 revenue shortfall for Visit Lex alone. Occupancy for the week of April 5th through the 11th down from 75.9% last year to 15% this year. So we are looking at a very bleak April, May, uh, into June. But there are some glimmers of hope in a bleak time. Beer seems to bring people together and it seems to be working for us right now. Last week, Ethereal Brewing opened its second location in town. It's difficult to, to have your grand opening be under quarantine. But it's here, open for curbside pickup and looking forward to welcoming old friends to a new spot. We're ready to, to get open full bore, but we just can't yet. While more than 90 meetings and conventions are canceled through June, Visit Lex reports that at least four meetings have been rescheduled for later this year. Visit Lex is also using its social media presence to promote the city's businesses and beauty. Raymer says you can even take on the mural challenge, a socially distant way to witness the beauty of a Lexington that has come so far this century. We have certainly as a community dealt with some hard times before and we've always rallied through those. Visit Lex, Keeneland and other partners launched Nourish Lexington earlier this year to provide meals for the needy around the area. Last week alone, they were able to serve 6,000 meals. Good news in a time where we all could use some. In Lexington, Conroy Deluche, LEX 18 News.